The most popular New Year's resolution is often the most broken one. Trying to lose weight's a great goal, but if you don't break it down into a specific plan, you might not stick with it. That's why registered dietitian Katherine Brooking has one easy change you can make to your morning routine to keep you eating right. Hi, I'm Katherine Brooking, registered dietitian and author, and today I'm here to share with really important tips on how you can keep to your New Year's resolutions. Now, a lot of people think that it's really hard to stick with those resolutions, but it doesn't and I've got a great new survey out that from Today's Dietitian magazine, and it was with 500 registered dietitians. And what they said was that one of the best ways to stick to your New Year's resolutions is to start the day with an oatmeal breakfast. Now, two-thirds of those surveyed said that breakfast is their most important meal of the day. And nearly half said that oatmeal was their top choice for breakfast. Now, I'm definitely in that group. I know Quaker oats have been in my pantry for many years, and they're certainly my top choice. And that's because they provide whole grains that give us energy to fuel our day and also keep us from getting hungry later in the morning. So it's really important to have those whole grains to keep us engaged and to keep us energized. It's a perfect way to start the day. So here are some really good swaps that you can do to get your New Year started off right. So let's say you're someone who loves French toast. Instead, try Quaker One Minute Oats, slice some apples on top, and then sprinkle some cinnamon and just drizzle a little bit of maple syrup. Now this will give you the sweetness that you might get in something like French toast, but you're also getting the energy, you're getting a, a, the whole grains, and also you know really gonna feel full for throughout the morning. So this is really one of my go-to breakfasts. Now another good idea for those of you out there who like a more savory breakfast, so say you're a fan of an egg and cheese sandwich, I use Quaker three minute steel cut oats and I top them with a poached egg and then I add a layer of turkey bacon and a little bit of cheese. So you can still have cheese but just sprinkle on some Parmesan or Gruyere. It makes such a wonderful hearty and savory breakfast. This is going to keep you full and it's going to keep you energized. Now there's a lot of other things that we can do to keep a healthy and happy new year. Um, we cannot forget about physical activity. So I always tell my clients that anything counts, any kind of movement counts. So find an activity you love and do it every day, whether that's walking or jogging or swimming. And it also helps if you have someone who you can partner with to keep you accountable. So someone to really keep you honest because I know when I go for a walk or run, it's really nice to have a friend along. And if I tell someone I'm going to be there tomorrow morning at 6 a.m., I'm going to show up. So really partnering up with someone who can be um, sort of your partner in fitness is, is really a good thing to do. Now, another thing for the new year is to make sure that you're getting adequate sleep. The recommendations are for about eight hours a night, and it's really important for us to deal with stress, to manage our eating. These are all linked so that sleep is another important factor in staying on track and in staying healthy. So for more great ideas, for more great recipes, definitely check out QuakerOats.com and have a healthy and happy new year.